Hello, welcome to Simple Answers. In this video, I'll be showing you how to use Spotify songs as ringtone on iPhone. The first thing you will need to do is go into your App Store on your iPhone. And from here, you're going to type in GarageBand. And you want to download GarageBand. And you're also going to download the app below GarageBand by the name of Ringtones Maker. You are going to download both apps. After downloading both apps, you are going to go into Spotify. Once in the Spotify app, you are going to find the song or songs that you would like to use as your ringtone. And you are simply going to swipe down from the top right hand corner or you are going to swipe up depending on the model iPhone that you are using. And you are going to turn on screen record. And by the way, if you don't see screen record on your iPhone, all you'll need to do is simply go into settings. And from here, you're going to scroll down and you're going to tap on control center. And in control center, you're going to scroll down and right where you see the green circles, you're going to see screen record and you'll simply tap on it. And that will carry to the red circle as you can see right here. And it will now be on your iPhone. After doing that, you can simply record the song as I said or songs that you would like to use on Spotify. Once you have screen recorded the song, the next thing you are going to do, you are going to go into the Ringtone Maker app that you had downloaded. And once you have opened the app as you can see right here, you are going to tap on the plus and you are going to tap on import from video. Then you are going to find the song that you had screen recorded. And it does show an ad now and then as it's a completely free app. You are going to tap on skip video. And X out of that. And you can see the audio has been added at the top right here. You are going to tap on the audio. Then tap on make. After selecting make you are going to wait a few seconds. Just wait a few seconds. And then you're going to tap on Garage Band, which is why I recommended that you download both app. Then you're going to tap on Continue. Then tap on Continue again. You want to tap. Then you're going to see the audio that you have downloaded, as you can see right here. You're going to tap on the audio. Once it has loaded up, just give it a few seconds. You are going to tap on the plus in the top right hand corner, right below the settings cog. And from here you want to tap on the bars and you want to carry the bars to 30. So you are going to carry it up to 30. Then tap on done. After doing that, you are going to tap on the arrow pointing down in the left hand corner. Then tap on my songs. And that will save the audio. Then you are going to have a long press on the audio. And you will see the option share. You are going to tap on share. Then select ringtone. And from here you can choose the ringtone name. So you can change the name. Then tap on export. And you can see that it is exporting. Just give it a few seconds. Then you'll tap on use sound as. And you'll select standard ringtone. And that's it. Hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe. And thank you for watching.